when I'm underwater, I just love the stillness. I feel very, very peaceful, very calm. And it allows my mind to focus more, I think, than when I'm out of the water. And that's really yeah, what, I, what I enjoy about working in that environment. I look, with a lot of my work, I, I'm looking at the underwater environment as an altered space. Not necessarily a watery, floatery space, but a space that um, is very, we react very differently. Time and uh, gravity and everything changes uh, when we're underwater. Become very aware of yourself within the present moment. Sound changes. The, the main senses that you rely on, your sight and sound, they completely change when you're underwater. For example, you can hear your heartbeat. You're very aware of the internal sounds as opposed to the external sounds. It's, it's, it's a space that's very, very um, undiscovered and sort of medium that evokes such extreme emotions in people from people who have complete fear, like my dad, who, who just can't get into the water, to being used for relaxation. People give birth in water because it's such a, an amazingly calming experience. I wasn't a huge swimmer when I was young. It's definitely more something that's come at a later stage I'm from Coventry, which is probably the furthest place from the sea <laughs> in the country. <laughs> the thing that drew me to the Lake District was I, I really wanted to find some natural water other than the sea uh, where I could, it was clear enough to photograph in. The Lake District has just such a huge variety of, of locations that you can use and I particularly wanted to work in Westwater Lake because it had, uh, it's so deep and, and has, it's just so clear, the waters are just really beautiful there. Amazing natural environment and to be surrounded by mountains, that is, apparently the lake is as deep as the mountains are high, so they say.